Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming here with another episode of Dragon Age Origins. Alrighty, when we left off, we had ran into Sten here, a uh, Kunari who is apparently uh, one of a very rare breed of Kunari who are apparently born hornless. Uh... This was actually a uh, evolving of the lore for the Kunari, uh, less than it was a uh, retcon, more or less. I believe I'm not. I'm still not entirely sure. I've I've read it as a uh, retcon in other no means, uh, mainly on Tumblr when I was still on that. Um, <laughs> I remember reading it as a retcon, but apparently, uh, maybe it was just an evolution of the lore. Uh, apparently there are Kunari who are born without horns, and they're fairly special among the people, and uh, actually considered in pretty high esteem because of it. So, uh, that's a thing. Uh, but it seems, for right now, I cannot actually get him into my party. So, for right now, I'm gonna go on the other quests, level up stuff. I'm um, taking out oh, uh, the bandits, which there's a couple of them right over there. Um, take this Alfred. Um, should probably turn these on. There we go. And on we go. Eventually they're following me. That's nice. Oh, joy. I'm getting beat the fuck up. Oh, joy. All right. There we go. Ooh, got to level up for the doggo. Nice. It's nice that you guys eventually followed me. Well, they're dead. Awesome. Well, we got one. One group of them, anyway. Uh, there's some of them. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Alright, I am very much hurt. Because no one's really helping me. Wow, this Mabari is tough as hell. Alright, alright. Oh! Alistair is dead. Oh, joy. Okay. Not, not good. Yeesh. Do you stop running, please? All right, there we go. I'll get on it. Okay, that worked out eventually. Okay, uh, Alistair, you, you have probably have an injury. Uh, let's level up Piff for now. Um, not sure how to level him up. Um. Yeah, let's add to uh, one of those for all of that. That works. Cool. Alright, so let's check on Alistair. Yeah, he has an injury. He's bleeding. Oh, joy. Uh, penalty to health regeneration. Joy. Okay. Um, let's try and deal with that then. Uh, swap to him so I don't fuck it up. Um, potions, maybe? Uh, injury kit? Where would that be? Yeah, lesser injury kit. I don't think so. That works. All right. Speak. Good. Okay. Um, have I ever looked into Morgan's spells? I don't think I did. But now that I think about it. Uh, okay. Hmm. 
No, I have not. Uh, still, I still do not get a heal. Of course not. Uh, I will absolutely make sure she gets one. Okay. Okay. My nose is a little stuffed up. I apologize. Give me a second to try and clear it. I'm still sick as hell. All right. I blew my nose. It helped a little. I've taken a nasal decongestant. That should help a little more. Uh, for right now, we continue. Uh, I think we got rid of most of the groups of them anyway. Uh, we can only hope for now that uh, there's only a few of them left. One of them apparently up in the ruins here. We'll take this elf root. Because at this, root, at this rate, I'm going to keep making health poultices. Uh, because I have no other choice. Whoopsie doodle. That was the wrong button. I meant to hit this one. Uh, advanced? No, not hold position. Um, although apparently I can do that to tell him to hold, um, move freely. So what did I, what was I trying to do earlier? Um, I think I was trying to go to talents. No. Sustain? No. Um, poisons and traps? No. What? what no. What what the fuck was I trying to do? Uh wasn't advanced. I have no idea what I'm trying to do. <laughs> the the fuck am I trying to do? Uh... Oh, I can change the party from here. Okay, fair enough. What? I know I did it for herbalism not that long ago. I did it last episode. Where the fuck am I supposed to go for it? Um... What... Did I do... There it is. It was in potions. That's where I needed to go. Okay. I guess I'll just make more. The flasks I have. Which was not enough. Uh, thought I saw some sparkles over here. I was right. Small metal round shield. Pretty decent. Okay. And I see more sparkles. At least for the elf root I can get that. What in... Is this place I can go into? No. Of course not. Okay. Fair enough. Well, there's another group over here, so I guess I have to go this way. Oh. Um. Since Alistair is more the, uh... Okay. Let's go to me, and I'll just take care of some of these guys. I had to make sure that at least we got someone started in the fight. But someone that wasn't me, because I'm squishy, as of right now. Okay, go over to you. Perfect. Go to the gen lock. And perfect. We did it. We helped people. And a, there was a blood mage? Sealed letter. A sealed letter. Okay. Take all. Um. Mighty timely arrival there, my friend. I'm much obliged. I know you two. You're in the second one. Uh, you're welcome. My name's Bodon Fedek, merchant and entrepreneur. This here is my son, Sandal. Say hello, my boy. Hello. Roads be hello. Really dangerous these days. Mind if I yeah. ask what brings you out here? Perhaps we're going the same way. I mean, I doubt you want to travel with a Grey Warden. 
grey wards. Hmm. My, that does rather explain a lot. No offense, yeah. but I suspect there's more excitement on your path than my boy and I can handle. Allow me to bid you farewell and good fortune, Dan. Sounds Goodbye. good. Now then, let's get this mess cleaned up, shall we? Yeah. Yeah. That, that this is a bit of a mess. You're not wrong on that. Ooh. A stronger uh, studded leather helm. And a gift. Cool. Oh, and this guy just has a sapphire. Well, that sucks. Alright, well. Yeah, some money. Always good. Alright, I guess we go over here now. And, uh, we should check on... My helmet was not great, if I recall correctly. Yeah, this one was rough. Uh, this one is slightly better. Studded helmet. Is this metal, or...? Huh. Studded helmet is just uh, rough hide. Okay. Cured, though. This would be better armor. All right. So equip that then. For now. Can't wear that yet. Definitely can't wear that yet. Eventually, I guess. Oh. About to sneeze. Give me a second. Okay. I hope that's sneezing all the mucus out of me. Because fuck, that hurt. <laughs> and it would not be good if that was not enough to get it out of me. Okay, cool. Well. Equipped the new helmet. And now I guess we go on to the next group of enemies, which is apparently over here. Foolish creature. It should know better than to attack. Uh... Okay, well, at least they came to us. Okay, wow, alright, I am still getting beat the fuck up. Uh, okay, could, could I stop getting beat up on, please? Or if you guys could actually help me, that'd be wonderful. There we go. Jesus. Whoa. The bandit leader had all of this? Shit. Heavy chainmail. Kunari thickened cap. A great sword. Holy shit. Oh, and there's a bandit over here. I should see if I can equip any of that. Uh, chainmail I can't yet. This, however. Reinforced leather, that's tier 5. Fair enough. Mental resistance. Huh. This helm does not display traditional marks of Kunari manufacture. Suggesting that the name is more commentary on stubbornness than accurate attribution. Okay, fair enough. Oh boy, now I need to fucking blow my nose again. Fucking hell, give me a bit. Man, oh man, I really hope that's the last I need to uh, cut out to deal with health problems. Otherwise, I'm going to be very upset. Alrighty, let's deal with them. I'm still getting beat the fuck up. Um, I guess I'm stuck. What the fuck was that? Alright, uh, steel, alright. I guess I can sell that. So there's no one in my party that can open that. No one, right? That sucks. Alright, well. At least I got a whole bunch of good stuff out of that fucking leader. A whole bunch of stuff. Landmark tree, huh? Your hound seems particularly interested in this landmark. 
What if I interacted? <laughs> okay. All right. Hmm. Why am I? Why was I surprised okay, by that? I don't think I should have been surprised by that. But, uh, I was a little. I'll admit. I was a little surprised. <laughs> but there you go. Oh. Now is better than later. Yeah, clearly. Oh, joy. Had to be big, giant spiders. Well, I can hear people clicking off the video already, just out of fear. I am stuck. I am stuck. Can I get unstuck, please? Thank you. Alright. Alright, well. Keep fighting. Keep fighting. Just keep fighting. Kill all the spiders so I can get the viewers back because they're clicking off out of here. There we go. Alright. They're now all dead. It's fine. A lot of toxic ex toxin extracts out of these things. Which I guess is good if you're making poisons, but uh, I am I'm not really into that. I was expecting more of a hole. Ah, well. That is an unfortunate phrase I just said. <laughs> okay. Um... Uh, I guess I gotta go down the normal way. And, uh, there we go. I guess. Done some killing. Didn't get a level up, but... Cleared the board, at least. Maybe I can, uh... Get some money out of that. And maybe some goodwill. Goodwill enough to uh, possibly get Sten on our team, perhaps. Uh, Chancellor Devons. Let him take notice and shine upon thee, for thou hast done his work this day. Alrighty. Okay. Hey, three gold. Holy shit. Alright, that is cool. Anything? Oh. A last keepsake, and when bears attack. On behalf of Thed the farmer and his departed son, I inscribe this missive. As the, maker's way, my, uh, as the maker is my witness, I charge all those with knowledge of arms and armor to brave the dangers of the northern wood to find the family of bears that mauled and killed the boy Eneth. For they are an abomination in the maker's sight, and their hides would prove great comfort to the normer, northern... I can't fucking talk today. To the northern farms... And solace for Thed's family. As Chanter for Lothring, I do pledge a sum of one sovereign to whoever carries out this, the Maker's will. Exercise caution first and foremost. May his light bathe us all. Alright, I guess we'll do that. Huh. A thanks to all villagers who've opened their barns and crofts to the refugees in these dark times. The Chantry regularly hears praise from our visitors, and your virtuous deeds are mentioned in many prayers. Sadly, there is a lone boy in the village whose mother, good wife Sara, is missing. I, I'm assuming that's how you pronounce that. Maybe it's Sarah. Well, as she has been missing for the better part of a week as of this writing, she is presumed dead. Oh. Oh no. May the maker bless her passing. She was a lady of middle years with red hair and fond of a green cloak. If any traveler or resident comes across her in the wilds, Please return her body or the effects on her remains. In later years, the boy will be thankful to have such keepsakes to remember his brave mother by. The office of the Chanter will compensate this kindness with the sum of fifty silvers. May the Maker turn his gaze on us all. Fair enough. Fair enough. Ah... Uh...
arrows are pointing in that direction, which makes me think maybe I can get them done without having to leave this area. I guess we can at least take a look, see? Well, there's wolves. They definitely were not here earlier. Oh, boy. There's a whole lot of them now. Okay, well, at least they're easy to take out. Okay. All right. It helps if I'm pointing in the right direction. There we go. Joy. I did the thing. Oh. You found the body of the boy's mother and have recovered her keepsake. Oh. Oh, that sucks. I was hoping that that would actually have a happier ending. Also, holy shit. Um, well. I guess since they're right there. Oh! Okay. Well, Alistair got a level up. That's nice. What about me? What am I going to get one? Well, that was impressive. Okay, Alistair. Um, level up. Hmm. Put more points in the Constitution, I guess. Because we are trying to make him our tank, more or less. Huh. Each of the Templar's melee hits against an enemy spellcaster drains his mana. Hmm. That's a hell of a talent. Mocking Bellow catches the attention of nearby foes, increasing their hostility towards the warrior. Which would very much start making him a tank, that's for sure. I mean, since that's kind of what I'm aiming for, I might as well. When is my next level up? I just hit the wrong button again. Uh, oh, I'm not that far away, actually. Hmm. Huh. Okay. Well, I guess I'll go back and uh, turn in those quests. And I'll grab this in the meantime while I'm doing so. Because eventually I'll be able to get more flasks and thus be able to make more poultices because boy I'm running through them really quickly I did not expect to run through as many as I have been but uh there we go and Chanter Devons blessed are the peacekeepers champions of the just and the stars stood still, the winds did quiet, and all animals of earth and air held their breath. All was silent in prayer and thanks. And money. Money, money, money. Hey! I got the level up. Hell yeah. Alright, so. Cunning determines how well a character learns and reasons. Combat tactics and herbalism. I I guess I kind of need to start putting some points into cunning, shouldn't I? And an observant eye can more easily find weaknesses in enemy armor, which essentially means it'll affect critical hits too. Rogues benefit most from this statistic, as many of the class abilities and special attacks rely on subtlety or reading the target, not raw strength. That said, it probably would behoove me to put a couple points in there. So I guess I should put at least two up 
strength by one. And that should be good. Now for talent. There's not much else I can do. At least in this regard. I'm not really allowed to hold on to the point either. Which is annoying, I might add. Huh. This only requires 22. And requires expert combat training, which I don't have. Huh. So I wouldn't even be able to adopt this anyway. Huh. That's annoying. I guess I can just continue along this and not equip the ability so that way I can eventually get to bravery. Yeah, I guess that's really the only good thing I can be going after. So, sure. Yeah, let's do it. Although I'm not equipping that as an ability. Absolutely not. Okay. That works. It's not ideal, but it works. Um, could I... No, not yet. I uh, kind of need to wait until 22. But once I hit 22, I absolutely will be wearing these. Ancient Elven Boots, though. Hmm. I have to be wearing an entire set of the Elven ones to be getting any benefit from it. Whereas for these... Oh. When equipped with a set of heavy chain mail armor and boots, the spells and or talents cost less to activate. I do have the boots and uh, chain mail. I'm currently wearing gray iron, right? Yeah, I am. Does it matter if the grade is different? Changes the color, but that's it. Huh. Fair enough, I guess. All right. I guess I'll sell some of the old stuff. Is there anything more? No. No other quests available. For now. I guess. All right. Let's talk to the merchant. Huh. Don't suppose you're looking to buy something. Uh, mainly to sell, but yeah. Let's all talk. All right. Just don't buy everything up. Wasn't planning on it. It's not yet. Uh... Check the other. Oathkeeper. Oathkeeper. That is better than the family sword I'm currently carrying. Plus 10 to healing effects received. And armor penetration is increased. Huh. A blessed blade. These long swords are often commissioned by the Chantry. And placed in the hands of their most able Templars as rewards for their accomplishments. Uh, I should probably hold on to this, this then. Uh, the great sword here I don't really need. I guess I can sell this dagger. Then again, I probably should hold on to the great sword in case Sten, when I bring him on, uh, requires swords like these. Probably do that. 
on the Warden's Longsword. I'll hold on to that for now. Uh, that one I don't think I need. Uh, this one I'll sell. So I don't see any need for that in the future, especially since it was gray iron. Uh, the dagger I'll keep along with Oath Keeper for now. Uh, compared to my current weapon, yeah, I'll, I'll definitely be taking that on. All right, red steel. Red steel, I don't remember this being here. Hard to get more basic than this metal hat. Also requires a lot more strength than I currently have. Huh. I... Huh. Alrighty. Reinforced leather. It's... It's a higher armor, but, my, but not by much. I think the heavy chainmail that I currently have is far better upgrade. Yeah, it is. Huh. All right, well, I'll sell a couple of these since I don't need them anymore. And I know I can't really go with this, so I'm just going to sell that for now. Sell one of them. Because I definitely don't, do not need both of them. Uh, did I end up selling the gloves by accident? Uh, I don't think I did. Chainmail gloves, no. No, I don't think I did. Well, I guess I'm still wearing those. <laughs> That's fine. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I think... I think that's good. I think that's good for now. Steel. Hmm. That would be decent, but I'm not willing to pay that for this. Especially since I have better ones and I just need to level up to get them. Yeah, I, I think I'll, I'll just opt out of that. Um, is there anything I can buy that I can use? Uh, for crafting, I, I kind of need flasks, but I'm noticing he doesn't have any to buy. That sucks. I only just noticed I had these. I can... Oh, wait, that's buying stuff. That's buying stuff I'm looking at. I'm stupid. Okay. Yeah, I'm still noticing he doesn't have flasks, but... Um, those are apparently things I can get at some point. Uh, yeah. Nothing really good. Um. I can sell half of these, since I haven't been really using them at all. Uh... Concentrated death root extract. I don't remember getting that. And let me see. Nothing really worthwhile here, I'm noticing either. Yeah, yeah, not really. All right, well then. Um, should probably equip Oathkeeper then, considering it's far stronger than my current sword. And steel to boot. There we go. Uh, I, I'd really like to carry one of these in the offhand, but I guess I'm not allowed to. Damn it. Oh well. 
Alrighty. Welp. Uh, since I can't level up any further, I guess I'll just uh, go talk to the revered mother. But for right now, I need to end the episode because we're quite a bit over time, even counting out all the health-related shenanigans I had to deal with. <laughs> so, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos. and you want to see more, click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together, and I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat, playing games, dying of ick, and uh, trying to help out with uh, the quests that we needed to take care of. Uh, hoping in eventually we'll get enough level ups to uh, be able to do something about uh, getting the Sten on our party because uh, I have a feeling it's going to be more difficult than what my current stats will allow me to do to convince her to let him go with me. Uh, I'm not entirely sure where I need to sit in that regard to be able to convince her. We'll see how it goes for you.